Hey love bugs, it's Ross, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed, I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for allowing me to, you know, just tell my videos and you're just giving me support as, you know, you're supporting me, I'm supporting you and, you know, we're just helping out each other and sending each other loving, uplifting vibes. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video. Or you're just opening up telling me about your impact, the gift, and how it's impacted your life and sending you towards a positive direction. And if you feel like the video has just gave you good vibes and you feel like it was, you know, something that you might want to share it with somebody, go ahead and please do so. And even while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. And thank you so much for, you know, stopping by my channel and for the support. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video today. And the beautiful meditation I'm listening to is 30 minutes meditation music for a positive energy, chakra balance and healing, balancing and healing, spiritual awakening. And I will post that link in the description box below. And the video I'm doing today is Twin Flame 101 Empaths Choose Which Battles Are Worth Fighting For. Yes, we have to choose which battles are worth fighting for. Because there's some of these things out here we have been dealing with for so long, it can become redundant. And you have to be able to say, okay, is this worth my time or am I just wasting time and I could be moving on to bigger and better things. And you have to really realize that because there's sometimes we can go through that rotating door of lesson of life so many times where you you, you should know every <laughs> every mistake that you already know that if you have to go through this one more time, you already know everything that you need to handle. And then sometimes it could be with jobs. It's just like if you know you're at a job where you feel like you're complaining enormously too much. It could be frustrating. It's especially, you know, if you're, you should be at a job where you're able to be happy. It doesn't stress you out. You know, jobs going to have, you know, it's deadlines and it's, you know, it's rules and regulations. That's just any place. But you need to be somewhere where you're actually happy to be there you know and sometimes that's hard to do if you know if you're stuck in a financial situation but you have to think about the healthier side of life you know it's just like yeah you know I got to get all these things done but it's just you know it's, you know I'm bringing my job home with me and I know I've had jobs like that where I had to go find me another job just because I was always constantly bringing my job home with me if there was like stress at the job where somebody was just trying to aggravate me or just trying to keep up you know drama I got frustrated and started thinking about it, you know, at home. But finally, it, you know, when it comes to, you know, times where I've even heard of people that, you know, that I've talked to and they're like, Rosalind, I just lost my job. And the first thing I come out and say, is this a job that you have wanted? <laughs> and then the first thing they were like, actually, no. I said, you've been complaining about this job for a while. And they were like, yeah. That, you know what? And it could have been something that, you know, you could have got a suspension for just even a, you know, a written, you know, memorandum or whatever they want to call it. But then they end up letting you go just over some petty stuff. But that was just the universe helping you out because they already knew you were going to be still sitting up there the next day complaining about the same thing that you've been doing for the last four or five years you've been sitting there at that job. So it's just like when we don't take care of the things that we need to take care of, the universe will push us on to doing it in the first place. So it's just like when we're going through things, you have to see, you know, if you're you're heading towards a goal or heading towards your blessings or working towards your dreams. Now, those are things that's worth fighting for because those are some things that you know you're going to have trials and tribulations. You're going to have setbacks, mishaps, mistakes, you know, misunderstandings, you know, misinterpretations. That's fine. Those are battles that are worth fighting for. Anything that is going to bring a positive gain to your life, those are the things that's worth fighting for. Things that are just draining you, you know, uh, 
just bringing you just automatic stress all the time. There's things that you need to change. There's things that, you know, and I have to tell myself that all the time. You know, some things aren't worth fighting for. You know, being in uh, situations will give you that wake-up call to let you know <clears throat> you can't keep going around doing the same thing you've been doing for so long. You need to be able to change so you can wake up and realize you deserve better. You need to be in a better spot. You need to be something, be where something is not toxic to your life or to your well-being. You have to be somewhere that is going to you know, bring joy to your life. You know, it's hard to do that sometimes, especially, like I said, if it's in a financial situation. But then you have to try to find, you know, <clears throat> you know, I know jobs are scarce out there anyway. But if you can, try to find something that, you know, fits you and, you know, fits your liking, you know, things that you love, enjoy, you know, enjoy doing, but you're actually, it doesn't feel like a job when you're doing it. So it, it's just like we always have to choose which battles are worth fighting. Whether it's, you know, job situations, relationships, you know, financial situations, you know, things have to change <clears throat> for the better for you. And so you have to really, like I said, you have to choose which battles are worth fighting for and which ones that you need to throw that little white flag up and say, okay, you know what, <laughs> this ain't even worth it anymore. You know, on to something bigger and better, especially if you know it's just not taking nowhere except around in that circle. And you know, in a circle, you're not going nowhere. So I hope you were able to get something out of the, you know, out of the content of my video. Hope everybody's having a blessed week. And today will be hump day by the time you get this. So, um, um, so I hope everybody had a continuing, you know, first few days of the week. Hopefully it wasn't too crazy. You know, if it is, you know, you can handle it. You know, it's always a new day for starting at something else new. So, no, um, much love to y'all, and like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. Drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you. Like and subscribe. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. And know that you are blessed and highly favored and truly loved, and know there is always somebody out there praying for your better days. And... You know, much love and light to you. And namaste, peace, and be wild.